remember at big when I was at school and we had like a I think it was like a discman or something whatever and we'd have it in our bag it was a C- we'd, CD portable CD player, CD player yeah. for those that and are I'd too young and I put the cord of the thing up here <laughs> and I'd have it in my ear my hand on the desk like this and listen to, <laughs> listen to music so I feel like we all had our things I still had one ear technically it was training me for this because I've got something in my ear now <laughs> I think that's why I could do it I remember and wish that uh, Philip Schofield, sorry, uh, Holly Willoughby apparently uh, exit ITV's This Morning program. Well, looks like your wish really have come to pass. ITV apparently has issued a statement and of course, Holly Willoughby also has put out a statement out there saying that she has taken a bow from hosting the ITV program This Morning Show. Well, things really didn't go so well for her. And of course, we've brought you some interesting details about it already. But this is, this is a literacy open axe news. This is the have for quality entertainment, of course. Uh, let's see exactly what really went behind the scenes after, uh, you know, uh, these interesting conversations of Holly Willoughby uh, taking a bow from ITV. For more news, please do watch like our platform here. Uh, let's know what you think about the episode we bring to you so far. Join us. Let's get interactive. Now, remember, we did bring you a report about Holly Willoughby apparently being uh, abducted. Um, and of course, someone uh, whose name is, uh, the police apparently did bring his name as um, Gibson. Uh, you know, is it Gibson or something like that? Well, uh, I mean, unfortunately, his name has escaped him. But the police, uh, the Essence police did bring some, uh, you know, uh, interaction out there that Holly Willoughby apparently is supposed to be in police safe, uh, you know, safety because a man apparently is plotting uh, to abduct her, not just that, to also, excuse my language, rape her. Now, in the midst of all these allegations, Holly apparently was silent about it, but we woke up to an interesting uh, release on her, uh, you know, her social media platform, especially on her Instagram page, and she said that she apparently has taken a bow from ITV. So for now, Holly will not be on ITV this morning program. Let's uh, put her tweet on your screen and see exactly, uh, you know, what she tweeted or said about, uh, you know, this whole thing. Some also have said that uh, it was a plot. Uh, Everything was apparently calculated because remember that, uh, you know, Holly had been tempted to leave the ITV franchise for years now. And uh, in the midst of this whole drama between herself and Philip Schofield, majority have also wished that the ITV franchise also at least uh, sent her off from the, from the scene so the, uh, the issue could be at least resolved and a lot of people could... Uh, Gain love, uh, you know, once again for the uh, the this morning program, but looks like he didn't really pay attention. Of course, uh, this whole you know abduction plot whatsoever, which some say it's even a calculated attempt to get their attention, uh, you know, from Philip Schofield and uh, Holly Willoughby, and of course, uh, it looked like it worked anyway. So let's put the tweet once again and see. Now this is what she says. She says, uh, "I have left ITV. Uh, no, uh, okay." I, I think it's supposed to be now, okay, but he said, she said no. Uh, I have left ITV, no, today, that after 14 years, okay, well, that's correct anyway. Uh, after 14 years, I will not be returning to this morning. Uh, to everyone who has ever worked on the show over the years, thank you so much. This is such a difficult goodbye. Uh, you are incredible, and I forever will be proud of what you've uh, done together. Thank you to everyone at ITV for being uh, supportive. To every guest uh, who has sat on the sofa, thank you. Most of all, thank you to the wonderful viewers. You have, uh, you've been loyal, uh, so supportive, and the very best company every day. Richard and Judy uh, said, we've only looked uh, after this show It will always belong to the viewers. It's been an honor to just be part of its story. And I know this story has many uh, chapters uh, left to go. Sadly, however, I I now feel I have to make uh, this, this decision for me and my family. I will miss you all so match so this was the tweet of holly uh you know will it be over there now uh various uh you know media outlets also have had interesting conversation going on 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 their platforms some have been saying that 
this is a calculated uh, you know, attempt by the ITV franchise because earlier we do remember that uh, some people have said that ITV wants to take off Holly Willoughby, but it looks like the franchise didn't know how or the approach to use to get her off. Some even also have said that it was also a calculated attempt by Holly Willoughby uh, to also take a vow finally from ITV after the drama between herself and Philip Schofield. I'm sure a majority of you apparently, uh, you know, have uh, seen all the uh, the tantrums that, you know, these two really have been throwing at each other. And uh, interestingly, this also uh, news about the abduction and uh, possible rape and all of that came into uh, this whole conversation, making it look as if someone is behind, uh, you know, plotting to take the life of Holly Willoughby. And hence, uh, the management, and of course, Holly Willoughby apparently, uh, you know, thought it wise to take a final bow from the ITV franchise. Some even say that Philip Schofield apparently is aware. So it uh, looks like Philip is gone, and Holly currently also is gone. Well, uh, quite very sad. When I did hear the news, I was a bit sad. So unfortunately, this morning program uh, will not see Holly Willoughby appear on the show anymore after 14 years of working with them it's it's been a very long journey not so easy uh i must be honest it's been a back and forth uh sometimes it's very sweet sometimes too it's a bit bitter and so uh, that's what really uh happened at the itv franchise but just in case you would want to know exactly what ensued between uh philip schofield and holly willoughby let's get you this video uh, which she apparently after returning from her uh, her long break she uh, apparently did throw philip schofield under the bass and of course that's where the generation of the uh, the whole tantrums really began. Take a look at this. This show holds for all of us. We can find strength in each other. Honestly, are you okay? I hope so. It feels very strange indeed sitting here without Phil. And I imagine that you might have been feeling a lot like I have. Shaken, troubled, let down, worried for the well-being of people on all sides of what's been going on and full of questions. You, me, and all of us at this morning gave our love and support to someone who was not telling the truth, who acted in a way that they themselves felt that they had to resign from ITV and step down from a career that they loved. That is a lot to process. And it's equally hard to see the toll that it's taken on their own mental health. I think what unites us all now is a desire to heal, for the health and well-being of everyone. I hope that as we start this new chapter and get back to a place of warmth and magic that this show holds for all of us, we can find strength in each other. And from my heart, can I just say thank you for all of your kind messages and thank you for being here this morning. Thank you for being here this morning. Myself, Josie, Aww. Derma, Alison, Craig, and every single person that works on this show will continue to work hard every single day to bring you the show that we love. So on that note, Josie, what's Mary, up? Come here, you bring it in. Bring it in. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. I need the Josie cuddle. Aww. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.